So a number of years ago, I developed my first invention to treat bone density. It became very apparent that humans are seven times stronger than they think they are. And the reason is we have vastly different capabilities of producing power in different positions of our biomechanics. And this wasn't really documented or understood before. So what X3 does is allows us to train with appropriate forces in different positions. So it uses extremely heavy latex banding to deliver the proper forces in the proper positions. So I'm holding much more force, maybe five to seven times the force here in this stronger position than I am in the weaker position. The success of X3 has also driven the success and the prevalence of band training. The problem with training with a band by itself is you have two options. Either the band is appropriately forced for rehab training. What we really see is rehab banding being repurposed for fitness, but nobody's gonna get stronger with 20 pounds. When individuals try to use heavier banding without a bar, this happens to the wrist. The wrist gets twisted, and these are some of the smallest bones in the body, and they can get damaged very easily. So you, there's a reason why we interface our feet with flat surfaces so well. There's a reason that our hand interfaces with a bar so well, because that's what keeps our wrist neutral. So we all get to train with a higher amount of weight than we normally would, with more repetitions than we normally would, all while protecting joints so that we get a more complete and more powerful stimulus to trigger muscle growth.